Hello again, everyone. Tep Evan 13 here. More Final Fantasy 3. We have found the thingy. I'm not sure I want to bring everybody. We'll see. I know, I know I have to keep two people, but we'll see. Here we go. Mastic? Marstic? She's scared, you know. Holy Jesus. Who are you? This girl is your friend. I is Marstic all right? You call her Marstic. Marstic. How odd. She is undamaged, but I fear she cannot understand you. As for me, I am Ramal, the Esper Ramal. Esper? But don't Espers live in another world? That doesn't mean we don't live here too. Espers take a variety of forms. Sometimes we live here, taking the shape of humans. You have nothing to fear from us. What? Why do you hide the fact that you're espers? Humans and espers can't survive together. But my grandma told me that espers and people once lived side by side. Was that just a fairy tale? No, that was no fairy tale. That was true. We started out as friends. Then along came the War of the Magi. War of the Magi? It took place long ago. Espers fought humans who were infused with magical power, extracted from Espers. As illustrated by this convenient flashback, Fearing our magical powers would once again become a target, we fashioned a new realm and moved there. About twenty years ago, humans stumbled upon it. Humans who knew about Espers and the secret of magic power. Thus began a hunt for Espers. Only in this way could Emperor Gestal create his invincible army. In response to this, we erected a doorway and threw the humans out. Even as we speak, many of my kind are trapped in the Empire's Magitech research facility, being drained of their powers. I fled here to avoid a similar fate. That's right, relax. I sensed that Marstic was in trouble, and my magic summoned her here. Marstic's an Esper? No, she is actually quite different. She looks like she's in pain. Her very existence strikes fear into her own heart. How can we help her? When she accepts this aspect of herself, I think she'll be alright. 
We have to do something. Then free those of my kind imprisoned in Gestahl's Magitech research facility. One of them can surely help her. So if we find the Magitech research facility, you're sure we'll find your people? Magitech research pe facility? Your, your people are... Like a coward, I escaped, leaving the others there. It'll be the end of them. What What do you mean? Gestahl's methods are incorrect. You can't drain a live esper of all its power. It is only when we are reduced to magicite that our abilities can be transferred in total. Pardon? When we transform into magicite, our power can be relocated. Magicite? That's what's left of us when we pass away. These are my comrades who fell while escaping the Empire. And I, too, will give you my power. That's a hell of a lot of trust. <sighs> oh man, are you really gone? Magicide. He traded his power so others might live. doing this. We few could help save many. The War of the Magi must not be repeated. Received Rama. Received Stray. Received Siren. Received Kirin. Wait for us, Marstic. We'll be back. Maybe I don't trade. Oh, yes, we do trade guys here. Everyone here, I was thinking, let's talk on the way. Oh, we're going to talk. The Empire is trying to trade magic from the Espers. This can't be true. Cat? I don't remember. I was asleep when they augmented me. But I have heard rumors to that effect. Hmm. Then we're going in. We'd best split into two groups. We still need to beef up our defense in Narsh. Indeed. I'll go to the Empire. I know it well. But uh, alone? Don't worry. I'll go with her. Korosu? <laughs> His old hand up there. You need a hand? So, eh, he volunteered. I think he wants to kick some Empire ass. Uh, Zoltan's not going to be very effective for a while because of... We've fought new things and we're not going to be able to get to the belt. Um, actually, I think I'm going to go with Orlock. Orlock or Eddie? Mm -hmm. Orlock's actually going to be really useful with his tools. And Janillo is basically just another form of Eddie with his dispatch. Except it's a lot easier to use. <laughs> so, yeah, we'll see how it goes. And we have to take these two idiots. Form one groups. Please wait for us in Narsh. We'll find our way back safely. Hey, we can change our group back in Narsh. 
So, how are we going to get there? The Empire is on a continent to the south. No boats go there. The people of Jador, a town to the south, can probably help us. Korosu. Yes? Why are you coming with me? Well, there's bound to be treasure. And besides, I've always wanted an inside look at the Empire. It's a ghosty. Seems you have a piece of magicite. Would you like to learn more? So you must equip your Esper, and then you can summon the Esper. And when you fight, you learn ability points, which unlock spells. And Espers will also give you certain stat boosts when you level up. Which is why you can do a low-level run until you start getting Espers, and then you can start making your guys fairly strong. It's pretty awesome. He's a tent. So I want to have full magic. Okay, let's get everybody equipped, because I know I've got new stuff for you. You're forged. For shield. Hey, you can actually have a green beret now. What the hell is the headband for? She can't even wear it. Weird. Everyone has green berets. <laughs> That's funny. God, I gotta find her a better weapon. Christ. Relics! I'm okay with that, actually. Because he's not going to be using fight. One second. Children! Okay. Um. Ah! Damn you, mouse. Okay, we're good. I think. Bizarre. Well, let's do some experiments with Janilla's damage while we're on our way back. Because so we can try him with the Genji Glove and we can try him with um, the thing. Ah! That's not what I meant to do. Oh, yeah, and we gotta equip with Espers too. Sorry. Okay. So, what do we have? Lightning Elemental gives stamina plus one, which is hit points. Uh, does not stat up. Magic power plus one. Hit points plus ten percent. Okay, so we want... Who are we? We want her to have magic power for sure, so we're gonna give her stray. Okay. And you can equip more than one Esper on the person, I think? No, you can only have one Esper for, at a time. Uh, stamina plus one sounds good. Base, magic, stat, growth, things, and whatever. I'm not all that fussed. Okay. I'm not going for an optimal setup. I'm just going for whatever feels right at the time. Though we do want a cat to gain lots of experience, or lots of magic power she levels up, and stray seems appropriate for her anyway. need to see... So your sword tech does... How much damage? Two hundred ninety-six. Now if he just 
fights, what does that do? More than 296. So, we'll have to see how it goes. And we get magic points. Instead of ability points. Excuse me, I was thinking ability points. Got him on the brain or something. So now there's reasons to fight again. Yay! 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 Boy, he's fast. I think he went before Cat did. Or after Cat did was when I gave her the command. See, and we've gotten four magic points, basically. So if you go to your espers, we can see, see, Bolt is a times ten learning rate. So for four magic points, we get 40%, and so on and so forth. It's actually got a fair good of progress on Bolt, too, which is awesome. And then... Kieran is already 20% of the way through Cure and Scan. Regen and Cure 2 take a really long time with Kieran, but there are better ways to get it later. Uh, Stray doesn't really have anything worthwhile. She already knows Imp, Muddle, and Float. Main reason she has Stray is so she can get magic power up. Because she has a pretty good base, base magic spells anyway, with Ice and Healing. And then he... has Siren? Yeah, he's already mostly learned sleep, and he'll learn fire eventually, which... Some things it's handy to have magic attacks for, because they have a high physical defense, or something of that nature. Anyway, I know it's about 17 minutes, but uh, it's mainly been talking, so I'm gonna go ahead and get Cat's weapons sorted out before I move on to the next thing. Hit him in the butt. Yeah. Oops, shouldn't capture the same guy. Oh well. Silly me. Oh well. See how effective even just Cure 1 is. And remember that place we can buy, um, earrings at. I think it's here, actually. So as we learn more and more magic, we could go full retard and go lots of magic weapons and things. It's good though. Oh yeah, we talked to that guy and then we left because we're idiots. <laughs> oh well.
I love the techno beats on that. Ancient dubstep. Performed by our ancestors. Uh, weapons. Weapons! Oh god, there's nothing for her to use. Oh wait, no, she can use a flail. Sweet. fight our way back down. Capturing the same guy, jerk. There we go. Free potions. Gotta remember free potions from the vultures, because that's awesome. See, we only got one magic from them. The mind candy is actually a fairly good fight this early on, because it's hard to get more than one magic point from a fight. Mind candy! Yay! Crappy damage, but eh, what are you gonna do? Yay, her magic power went up. Huzzah! It's just that easy, folks. Steel? What kind of crap is that? I think you might be able to get AP by f or magic points by fighting on the belt, but I can't remember. Because I know you get experience, but you do get gold, so that might be a good way to get magic points if you just want to learn spells without over-leveling your guys. Like, say you want someone to learn a specific spell, but it takes a long time to learn, and you want them to have the guy that gives them, like, plus five strength every time they level up. do a fair bit of damage between those two. I'd also like to get her to learn I, uh, Fire and Bolt, too. That way you have the holy, holy trinity of magical effects. Once we get to the Empire, we want a lot of people to know Bolt, because there's a lot of machine enemies there. So actually... Learned Bolt. You've got Ramo, right? Uh, kind of depends if I want to spend time... Oof. Eh, it only takes five fights with mine candy, though, so I don't know. I might level up a little bit before we move on to the next part. Just to get everybody bolt, because like I said, it wouldn't it wouldn't suck having everyone have bolt. So yeah, I think I'm going to do that. But I'm going to do that off camera. I'll see you guys next time. Next week? Who knows? Depends on when you're watching this. If you're watching it in the future, you'll probably see me in a minute or two if you feel like watching another episode. Hard to say, but pace yourself. It's a long story. And it's not about any, not about the ending. It's about the journey. When you come on the final fantasy. And, you know, I'm sure there's only like seven or eight more of them. But whatever, that, that's besides the point. Anyway, I'll see you guys next time. Thanks for watching.